The morning after BTB Savage died here on this Houston street, police in New Braunfels, Texas arrested the man now wanted for his murder, but that was on an unrelated drug charge and that was before there was enough evidence to charge him in the rapper's death. The elaborate plan to kill rapper BTB Savage started taking shape four days before he died when court documents reveal one of the suspects, Montrell Burley, rented a black Subaru Outback about 26 hours before more than 60 rounds rang through this River Oaks area street, license plate readers captured the Subaru traveling toward Houston from San Antonio. A couple hours later, investigators believe the rental car plates were swapped with plates from a stolen Kia out of Harris County. Then, for more than four hours the night before, and for about four hours leading up to the shooting, cell phone data shows Burley in the area of BTB Savage's apartment, one of several investigative techniques detectives used to get a murder charge. They'll be able to use whatever the law permits that will make sure that while you think you can run, you can't hide. License plate readers caught Burley's car traveling back toward San Antonio in the moments after the 6.10 p.m. shooting. By the next morning, investigators had a search warrant for the rented Subaru when New Braunfels police arrested Burley for drug possession charges. Detectives questioned him about the rapper's murder when he told them he wasn't with the car around the time of the shooting and asked for an attorney when asked who he let use the car. If all they had is reasonable suspicion and not probable cause, you cannot be held beyond that 72 hour time frame unless and until charges are filed. Documents reveal Burley, a known and documented gang member, was friends with a man killed by BTB Savage and his fiance at their San Antonio apartment in February. The man allegedly tried to rob the couple at gunpoint when they shot and killed him in a homicide ruled justifiable. BTB Savage talked about that experience in this Vlad TV YouTube interview published the same day Burley allegedly rented the Subaru that he's accused of traveling to Houston in to kill the rapper. The rapper's mother called her son's death retaliation. It ignited a fire to where they were saying, oh, we're going to kill you. I just want the truth to be told and justice to be served. Police have still not identified a second suspect in this case. Tonight, they're asking anyone with information about where Montrell Burley is or who the second suspect may be to call Crime Stoppers. In the River Oaks area, I'm Bryce Newberry, KPRC 2 News.